Okay, I'm Jason Danielson and welcome to NAB 2012. This is the NetApp booth and I want to talk about how we're consolidating workflows and how we talk about this with our customers here at the show. This is using the E-Series line of storage that we bought from, Net, from LSI Logic about a year ago. Uh, specifically, if we zoom in here on this screen, we're using Final Cut Pro as a way to show the bandwidth for video read-write uh, that's capable out of this system. Here we're showing about five or six uncompressed video streams playing uh, directly to the workstation. That's using a uh, fiber channel, actually four channels of fiber channel coming out of a Atto uh, HBA card in the Apple workstation that's in this kiosk. You notice here we've got a timeline uh, here showing multiple tracks of video and they're playing up here. I'm going to start this timeline over at the beginning at the beginning of this timeline, we have seven streams playing. Now these seven streams times 158 megabytes a second nets us very close to a gigabyte a second. So you're going to see here on this centricity bandwidth monitor, you're going to see that bandwidth climb up to the 950 megabyte per second to gigabyte per second range. And yes, it's done that now because it's playing back these seven screens here. So that's what we're showing in terms of E-Series uh, with the Storenext file system, something we call the Media Content Management Solution. We're selling this into both uh, film production at 2K and 4K resolutions, as well as uncompressed video, and also for broadcasters down at lower uh, bit rates. Now, we've got a couple of other videos for you, one highlighting the 5460 enclosure itself, uh, which has 60 disk drives and a four rack unit high box. That provides 750 megabytes per second per rack unit. Uh, we are also going to be showing the content demo talking about storage grid uh, for long-term and multi-site uh, media repositories. Thank you very much.